This is a quick summary uh, of our plenary week here in Strasbourg, which is about to come to an end. Uh, it's the end of our midterm reshuffle, essentially, where all of the committees uh, re-elect their chairs or have new chairs. We've also elected a new president of the European Parliament, Roberto Metzola. For my own part, um, some very minor changes. I've been made a full member of the Development Committee, which is work that I really enjoy. So I'm looking forward to getting stuck into the agenda in 2022. I've also been made a substitute member of the Women's Affairs Committee, known as the FEM Committee. Uh, this is new work for me, but something I'm very interested in and I look forward to engaging. I will continue my responsibilities as a full member of the Trade Committee and also uh, the Renew Europe uh, member on the UK Contact Group and representing Renew on the uh, Partnership Assembly with the UK. So a huge agenda in 2022 for me. We've had a really interesting week here. A highlight as far as I'm concerned is an outstanding speech by President Emmanuel Macron uh, where he spoke uh, from uh, uh, without notes uh, on his passion for Europe and how he approaches the presidency of the council over the next six months. So a huge agenda for 2022 and very much looking forward to it.